NASA and the nation embark upon an ambitious journey to take us farther into space than ever before. As we reach out and explore the beyond, we'll create new jobs right here on Earth. Innovative, cutting-edge research and development in aeronautics and space technology will fuel the American economy far into the future and inspire a new generation of scientists, engineers, and explorers. We do a lot of great things in space. Spending money is not one of them. 85% of the NASA budget goes outside the agency uh, to American manufacturers and their partners so that we can help to produce the technologies that are needed for the exploration and innovation that we do. NASA's best days are certainly in front of us as are America's best days. The investment in science and technology and R&D uh, returns unbelievable benefit to Americans and to our economy. Despite having to make tough choices in these economic times, the fiscal year 2013 budget advances a dynamic aerospace program envisioned by the President and strongly supported by a bipartisan majority in Congress. It will enable more remarkable discoveries here on Earth and deep in space. This budget proposal supports important progress in building the next generation deep space crew capsule, Orion, and development of a heavy lift rocket designed to carry astronauts beyond low Earth orbit. It's pretty exciting seeing those vehicles uh, start to come to life and start to see where they're no longer just concepts, but actually to see hardware come together. So that's a pretty exciting field as we're really getting ready to go beyond low Earth orbit to leverage off of what we've done with station and then push further out into the, uh, into the solar system. It will enable expanded use of the International Space Station. This one-of-a-kind research laboratory will improve life on Earth and make great leaps in scientific discovery and serve as the foundation for sending humans deeper into space than ever before. We have a wide variety of science going on board. We made an uh, award to a nonprofit organization to manage the National Lab portion of the space station. This uh, opens the door, not just to other government agencies, but even private industry, industry that may want to test vaccines or material processes for fighting disease, for manufacturing, for potential technology spin-offs. I think the benefits uh, are yet to come. And to keep the space station fully crewed and supplied, NASA will continue vital investments in its partnerships with American companies working to launch a new era of spaceflight, one that will create jobs, stimulate the economy, and decrease our reliance on foreign launch providers. It's a pretty dynamic time watching this, this new industry come to life. It is truly those partnerships that are going to allow us not only uh, to reduce the cost of getting to and from space, but to travel farther than anyone has ever before. Instead of outsourcing our space program overseas, we intend to insource our space program and have Americans continuing to explore the space frontier. American manufacturers producing American-made vehicles to take our American and partner astronauts to low Earth orbit. I am very bullish on American industry. Next generation technologies are needed to safely send humans on long-term missions through deep space to places like asteroids and Mars. NASA is investing in developing those capabilities with investments in research and high-risk, high-payoff technology projects. Some of the work that we're doing in the Office of the Chief Technologist provides a means for entry, descent, and landing at Mars, for example. And that kind of work is essential to being able to execute uh, our vision. Investment in creative awards and competitions will spark game-changing thinking and innovation. It gives us the chance to sponsor small companies through large companies, through small business innovation research grants, uh, all the way up to large-scale missions, centennial challenges, bring in uh, non-traditional contributors from all across the nation to solve problems, hard problems, in the service of NASA and the nation. NASA's array of groundbreaking science missions will reach farther into our solar system, reveal unknown aspects of our universe, and provide critical data about our home planet. The James Webb Space Telescope 
due to launch in 2018, will reach back in time to revolutionize our understanding of the origins of the universe. And NASA is working to better integrate and coordinate its robotics and human exploration efforts to meet the goal of sending astronauts to deep space, including asteroids and the Martian system in the 2030s. As an astronaut and an astronomer, it makes perfect sense to me that our human spaceflight program and our science program would work together to meet our future exploration goals. Even today, as MSL is on its way to Mars, we're actually gathering radiation data. And that's one of the big unknowns that, that we really need to understand. How much shielding do we need to put in our spacecraft? So here we've got a chance to actually capture data during a, a science mission that will have direct application to the human mission in the future. We also learn about the origins of Mars, the origins of the solar system, uh, even the origins of Earth. So I see uh, the goals really very well aligned. It's not exploration about robotics or exploration about humans. It's the combination of both that gives us a much stronger program. And to protect Earth, NASA is gathering critical data that will help us understand our planet's changes, improve our response to natural disasters, and, in concert with other government agencies, monitor and address potential threats from asteroids, solar flares, and other space phenomena. NASA Aeronautics continues its cutting-edge research to enhance aviation safety and airspace efficiency while reducing the impact on our environment. The near-term uh, benefit would be improving uh, air traffic management and to gain a lot of operational efficiency. And in the mid-term, uh, we are trying to uh, provide technologies that will address emerging needs such as unmanned aerial systems. And in the far term, NASA Aeronautics research will bring these revolutionary concepts um, that may look uh, completely different from today's aircraft. Science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, STEM, the educational foundation of our future. NASA will continue to inspire young Americans about careers in the STEM disciplines and pursuing their dreams as our next generation of scientists, technologists, engineers, and astronauts. Our space is itchy. Every mission that we have has an education component. Hello, Earth! We get sunrises and sunsets 16 times a day. Astronauts up on the International Space Station, they can beam into classrooms and having a student ask them questions about living and working in the space environment. We also have a fantastic mission with Curiosity, and this rover is going to be able to traverse the Martian surface and take samples and make measurements that can be beamed back into classrooms to inspire that next generation of explorers. The 2013 budget proposal, tough, yet sustainable choices that provide stability and continuity to America's aeronautics and space exploration programs and sets the right pace for unfolding the next great chapter in humankind's exploration of space. A lot of people will focus on what can't be done with limited resources. I choose to focus on what can be done and incredible things can and will be done. It's a sound budget for us and it keeps us moving forward and making good progress through this next year. Technology and innovation at NASA are central to our mission and central to what the nation needs. This budget will allow us to continue to make great discoveries and unravel the mysteries of the universe. 30 years from now, the small kid growing up right now would say, wow, this was what NASA Aeronautics worked on 30 years ago. I'm still very excited about the opportunity to inspire and motivate children because the children are our future. NASA carries the hopes and dreams of the country and of the world. New ideas, innovative ideas, new things that make life better for people here on Earth. NASA, continuing leadership in aerospace exploration, scientific discovery, innovation, and job creation, all to ensure America's continued world leadership and secure our nation's future with a space program that's built to last.